Okay, let's talk about the people that's often overlooked and underappreciated. So check this out, right? A parent, a parent can have a, a, a father or a mother can have a good kid and not even know it. So they will underappreciate and overlook the kid they have for somebody else's kid. But they, you know, some parents, they will get mad when uh, like a, a, a relative a relative girlfriend, uh, they they had told a parent of mine. They had told a parent of mine, "Oh, I would uh, I would trade in all you know." But she got a couple kids. I, I I would trade in all my all mine you know my kids for you know one of you. You know, see, she told me that, and she told one of my parents that. So I'm like this: you can't get mad. If somebody else sees what a great kid you got, you know, that your kid, you know, don't get in trouble, you know, like a lot of other kids, you know, is not into a lot of stuff, you know, it, like I said, a kid of his own, you know, one of a kind. So this happens a lot too, a, a lot with a lot of, uh, a lot of kids. It's, it's, it's some good kids. It's not getting into no trouble. You know, they, they work, come home, you know, they do what they do. They, they might play their video games or do their hobbies they love to do, but they, some of them never been in trouble, never been in trouble with the law. And, you know, it's very, you know, respectful. So you have some strangers that will see that and they will give, you know, your kid credit. So I appreciate, uh, her telling me that. See, I respect. I respect that. Even you know, from a stranger, just like they say, the ones you know. I'm gonna say this all the time. The ones you know will be your, some of your big, biggest critics and your biggest haters. But strangers will be some of your biggest supporters and your biggest. Uh, inspiration, some of your biggest uh, motivation, you know, come from strangers. Str you know, strangers that will realize your greatness while your close ones will be blind to it. You know, that, but that's, that's life. You know, you have, you have a lot of, uh, what people don't understand, you have a lot of parents that wish they had that, that good kid you got. You know, the good, uh, you might have a righteous kid, you know, that don't do much wrong. You know, it's parents that have kids that can't stay out of trouble, can't stay out of jail, can't stay out of the street. And they wish they can trade, even if they got 10 kids, they would trade their 10 kids in for your one kid. You know, but people don't understand that. You know, let's move on to the next one. You know, you have loyal people, which one of my uh, best subjects. You have loyal people that's often underappreciated, often overlooked. You know, the loyal man is often underappreciated and overlooked. The loyal woman is often underappreciated and overlooked. So, it's like, like they say, you never know what you got to is gone. But like I said, when it's gone, a lot of times it's too late. And what y'all got to understand about, like, uh, loyal and faithful people, it, it's, it's not many. It's not like it's a whole, it, it's not like it's common to come across, you know, a loyal. That's like they say, loyalty is tough to locate because it seems like everybody's so fake. So, if you get a chance to come across a loyal being, whether it's a woman or a man, then it's best you try to hold on to it. You know, even if it's a friend, you know, try to hold on to them because what, what people don't realize is not common. You know, like they say, real is rare and fake is everywhere. So, loyalty is not everywhere. 
You know, you have some woman there tell some men, oh, you act, you act like you the only Lord uh, dude out there. Nah, it ain't that they act, it ain't that they the only Lord one out there. It's very, it's very, you know, few that are still Lord. You know, most people, the right opportunity, they going, they going to step out on you. So if you got somebody that won't do that, then that's you know that's one and that's that's like one of one in a million right there but like i said it's like nowadays it's like it's like it's no loyalty the same with the internet mess it's like people flip flop on the you know whoever's hat they it's not it's not really no loyalty you know loyalty red you know so wherever you find it i mean hey try you know your best to church and hold on to it because hey it, it, it ain't like it's a whole lot of uh, ones like that that exist. You know, same with...